Compared to classmates, BMW cars are expensive, but appreciated due to their high driving performance. We talk about the important nuances that you should pay attention to when buying the most affordable Bavarian, the BMW 1 Series. The BMW 1 Series has rear axle drive and a longitudinal engine. In the Golf class, this is almost unique, other manufacturers in this segment offer only front-wheel drive cars. There is a reason for such a conservative technical solution, the car differs significantly from its competitors in character and corresponds to the established image of the BMW brand. The cheap model, of course, did not work out, but still it is more affordable than the third series machines. This was especially important for fans of the famous German automaker, whose ranks have noticeably increased thanks to the appearance of the penny in Western Europe. And in Ukraine, the car aroused considerable consumer interest. The five-door hatchback is an atypical body for BMW, but in all other respects the car of the first series is a thoroughbred Bavarian even externally. A short front overhang, a swift profile with a cabin pushed back and swollen front arches are clear generic features of the brand. In technical terms, the corporate cannons are respected, the engine is located above the front axle, the suspension of all wheels is independent and the weight distribution is ideal, 50-50. Hence the special Bavarian character of behavior on the road, good dynamics, very tenacious brakes, harsh, for the sake of handling, suspension. The interior is largely reminiscent of the older 3 Series. Finishing materials, though simpler, instead of soft plastics, hard ones dominate, but everything is in order with the quality factor and German quality. The interior of the smallest model in the BMW lineup is frankly cramped, especially for rear passengers. However, a sufficient range of adjustments of a well-designed seat allows the driver of almost any height and build to sit comfortably. BMW is valued primarily for the explosive nature of the engine and the thoroughbred timbre of the voice, and they put up with its veracity. As for the older models, a wide choice of engines is offered for the Unity. Until 2006, only gasoline modifications were supplied to Ukraine, 116i with 1.6-liter engines, 115 horsepower. 118i and 120i with 2-liter engines, 129 and 150 horsepower, respectively. In Europe, in addition to them, two more turbo diesel versions were sold, 118d and 120d with a volume of 2.0 liters and a power of 122 and 163 horsepower. A year later, a 3-liter V-shaped petrol 6, 265 horsepower, appeared. When restyling the car in 2007, all engines, except V6, were upgraded, and their power increased. So, 1.6 liter gasoline engines began to develop 122 horsepower, 2.0 to 143 and 170, and turbo diesels, 143 and 177 horsepower. In addition, another version with a diesel engine has been added, 123D with a capacity of 204 horsepower. And a modification of the coupe 135 with a 306 horsepower petrol 6. All engines are reliable and durable. The timing chain drive is designed for a lifetime. The service interval for engines is not strictly regulated by mileage and is determined by the call. The built-in electronics determines the degree of production of the chemical components of the oil and lights up a warning signal on the dashboard. In particular, with a calm driving style, the mileage of gasoline units between maintenance can reach 30,000 km. However, this does not mean that they do not have congenital defects. The oil appetite of BMW engines is quite large. So, a serviceable 265 horsepower 6 can burn up to 1 liter of oil per 1,000 kilometers. For motors with smaller volumes, waste is not so significant, but you also need to monitor the level. The second characteristic feature is an increased risk of overheating, which often leads to the repair of the blockhead or the need to replace it. To prevent a catastrophe from happening, you need to carefully monitor the temperature of the coolant and the state of the cooling system, and when the emergency lamp flashes, immediately turn off the engine and contact the service. There may be several reasons. Most often, these are clogged radiator cells or antifreeze that has lost its heat removing properties, it must be changed at least once every two years. Many nodes went to the penny from other models of the brand. These are not only engines and gearboxes, with modifications and changes, from the three rubles, but also elements of the chassis. In particular, the McPherson front suspension with aluminum levers is the same as that of the 5 Series car, and the rear steel multi-link copies the triple. The survivability of the one suspension elements, like other BMWs, is low, and some of them can be considered consumables. Already by 25 to 30,000 km, the front shock absorbers may fail. Tie rods usually go 35 to 40,000 km, but the front stabilizer struts can withstand 50 to 70,000 km. 
For excellent braking properties, the penny pays with a short service life of the discs, they are usually enough for two brake pad changes. All CPs are reliable. Their resource is quite large, however, when choosing a used copy with a machine gun, it must be diagnosed at a service station. It is quite possible that the clutches of an automatic transmission are already very worn out. The life of a manual transmission clutch largely depends on the style and manner of driving, but often it goes more than 100,000 km. The BMW 1 Series has a few buts. The first is the likelihood of a criminal past. Secondly, diesel versions are economical, but very demanding on the quality of fuel and service. Both of these can cause problems. And the third thing, when purchasing this car, one must be aware that its maintenance will cost no less than a BMW 3 ruble note. All engines are quite reliable, have a considerable resource and common proprietary shortcomings. They are demanding on the quality of fuel and maintenance, they often sin with a large waste of oil and are afraid of overheating. To avoid problems, it is necessary to monitor the level of lubrication in the crankcase, the cleanliness of the radiator, and change the antifreeze at least once every two years. Mechanical gearboxes practically do not fail until the end of the engine life. Automatic transmissions are also durable, but when buying a used car, it is imperative to diagnose the automatic transmission at a company service, otherwise repairs can be very expensive. Since the build quality and corrosion resistance of the body is high, rust, as well as uneven gaps, is a sure sign of an unprofessional body repair. Front suspension elements can be considered consumables, for example, shock absorbers usually fail after 25 to 30,000 km, tire rod ends withstand one and a half times more, and front stabilizer struts need to be replaced every 50 to 70,000 km. Rear shock absorbers go twice as long as the front ones. The car is equipped with disc brakes all around. They are very efficient, but the wear on the discs is high, they usually only need to be changed half as often as the pads. 